Hi guys, uh, so if your internet time synchronization fails in Windows 10, so let's fix this error. It's very easy. Let's move to first method. Just search services in the Windows 10 search box. Now click on services to open service manager window. Now find and locate Windows time service. Okay, double click on it. If it is stopped, click on start to start the service. If it is already running, click on stop and click on start to restart the service. After that, change startup type as automatic. Now click on apply and click on OK and your problem will be fixed. Now if the problem is still there, let's move to method 2 and that is just run these two three commands in the command prompt window. Just search CMD in the Windows 10 search box, right click and click on run as administrator now you have to run these three command first of all we will stop the time service okay after that we will unregister it and re-register it okay basically we are re-registering the service first we will unregister and then register okay and now try again now if this problem is still there let's move to method 3 and that is just search time date and dot cpl in the Windows 10 search box. Now click on time date dot cpl. Now click on internet time. Now click on change settings. Now select a different time server. Okay, whatever is given, just select a different time server. Click on update now. Now the Windows time synchronization will happen with a different internet time server and it may fix your problem. Now, if the problem is still there, let's move to the last method. And that is we have to go to this link from nist.gov okay for downloading the internet time service okay open a browser of your choice and go to this link i have pasted this link in the description of the video going below you can directly copy the link from there you can click on the link from there now scroll down at the end of the page and where you will find this download nist time 32 bit xc just download it okay once it has been downloaded, just right click and choose as run as administrator and now click on yes and now it will change your time server, uh, it will change your time, it will update your time with the current time server. So that's it guys, please do like the video to support us and thanks for watching the Geek page.